Welcome back to Technique Week with Drea. I'm Drea and today is Whacking Wednesday. Whacking has become more and more popular in the Bollywood dance circuit due to its similarities to the flowing hand gestures of Kathak. Today we're going to learn three whacking techniques. Let's get into it. Okay, so basic whacking technique. We're going to start with our right hand. I'm going to do it in fists at first. So first we're going to bring our arm forward and we want it to be straight. Your elbow stops in line with your shoulder. Then we're going to curl your elbow in towards your body. I'm just changing the angle so you can see. Bird! And then take your elbow out to the side and behind your head, okay? So right now it's behind my back like this. Then you're going to bring your hand over and as you, bring your, as you bring your arm forward, your elbow comes in to throw it away. All right, we're going to take our left hand now. So remember elbow towards the front, take it in towards you, I mean out towards the side, and then forward, keeping your elbow out and then towards the front. That's it to throw it away. And if you want to make it really nice and clean, make sure your hands finish here not here, okay? Because often when we start learning, we have a tendency to do something like that. Okay, so we're going to go right hand elbow forward, make sure it's lifted to the side, two, three. Now when my hands come to the back, I'm going to be having my wrist facing up. So two and three. Okay, so let's do right hand, then left hand, then both hands together. So it's going to go one, two, three, and throw, left, one, two, three, and throw, both, one, two, three, and throw, one, two, three, and throw. Now there's a bunch of different ways you can do this. You can do it closer to your midline, kind of like you're putting on mascara. This is an analogy that Juanita Sears told me once, I really liked it. So you're putting on mascara, like ooh, up the eyes. Or you can do it out to the side. It's kind of like you're framing two big shoulder pads. So space age, you know, Game of Thrones style shoulder pads. You can also do it with lovely open palms and wrists. Okay, I like that style, that's my preferred style. Okay, so you can do lots of lovely flowing hands and graceful wrist movements. Either way is fine. So let's try it now with open palms. Ready? So palms are open towards you. They flip back like you're trying to get a high five behind your head, towards your face, like you're framing, you're really cute. And then away, let's try again. Pick it up, elbows come out behind your head and throw. Let's do open palms, right, left, and then both. And then we're gonna do it with some music. So one, two, three, and four. You can also pop your chest a little bit, both hands. Pop, three, and four, one more time. Two, three, and let's do it again. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's try it with music. Okay, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Left. Now both. Again. Keep those elbows up. Both. Okay, let's take a quick break. We're going to do it with fists now, okay? So kind of like we started curling the fist and you can still Use your wrist a little bit, all right? Five, six, seven, right hand. Left, both. And again. And left, and both. Whoops. Oh, I keep clamping my hair under my armpit. Do you see that? Okay, let's learn our next technique. So this is a little trickier. So what it involves is alternating arms. We're going to start with the first one. So it goes, right hand goes up, it goes behind. That's when our left arm starts. And then it goes behind. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, and finish it, okay? So it only breaks your brain a little bit, okay? We're at like this level of brain breaking. We're going to pick it up as it comes behind, start again, and 
try not to think about it. Yeah. And then we groove, and then we groove, and then we groove, and then we groove, and then we groove. Okay. Have you got that one? All right, we're going to practice it with music in a minute. Let's learn the second part of the alternate hands technique. So, this one is a little trickier. It's going to break your brain this much. Okay, we're going to start with our right hand, one. And as this goes to the back, we're picking up our left. And now throw, we've changed it. We're going to throw it and throw it. That's one set, okay? Pick it up, pick the second up. And if you remember, basically, where each hand has to touch. So as it comes up here, elbow is forward and hand is touching the front. As your elbow comes out, it goes towards the back, touches the front again and down. So those are our three, wait, our one, two, three, four points. And each time you have to hit those four points, but you have to hit them at different times. So just try and feel those places on your body, maybe give them a little pinch so you know where you have to hit. And then try not to think of both hands at once because like you will literally break your brain. Don't do that. Okay, so we're going to start one hand and now try to stop thinking. Three, five, six. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five. Do it again. And one, two, three, four, five. Do it again. And one, two, three, four, five. Do it again. And one, two, three, four. From here, let's see if we can continue. So we're going to throw this away, finish it off, and at the same time, start the next set. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Were you not ready for that? Let's try it again. Ready? So when we are here, we're just about to throw it away and finish it. But when we're throwing it away, we're picking it up. Okay? So throw it away and pick it up. Ready? Five, six, seven, going. One, two, three, ready? Pick it up. 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 Two, three, four, five. Okay, guys, we're going to do it with music. We're going to do right hand, left hand, together two times. Right, left, together two times. Take a pause. We're going to do the simple alternate. Okay, and then we're going to do the tricky alternate. So take a pause for that. We're going to do the tricky alternate. Do it once, take a pause. Do it once, take a pause, continuously. Ready? Five, six, right hand, here we go. Left hand. Both hands. And let's do it again. Left. And both. Okay, ready? I'm going to just move my hair. All right, and we're going to do the first alternate one. Ready? Five, six, five, six, seven, eight, one. Back, change. Back, one. Back, change. Back, one. Back, change. Back, ready? And finish it off. Good job. Let's do it again. Five, six, seven, back, one. Back, and change. Back. You can change the angles of your body. You pop your booty. Back, six, seven, eight, and one. Okay, let's try the tricky alternate. Ready? So let one go and just let it follow. You have to hit all of those different points. Just a different time. No biggie. Back. Again, one, two, three, four, break. Let's try it. Open palms and one, two, three, four, break. And again. Okay, let's try it continuously. Here we go. That's it. Try not to do that face, Drea. Awesome. Okay, we're going to do two alternate ones, the tricky one. And then do it constantly. Ready? Five, six, seven. And you can do it with this, you can do it with open hands. Nice. Ready? And constantly roll. Try not to forget what you're doing. 
the game, just rewind and keep on doing it. Otherwise, let's move on to technique number tres. Okay, technique three, let's get weird and multi-dimensional. So this is one of my faves. If you've seen our LA love video, we do that a little bit in this video. So basically we're gonna turn our body towards our left corner. So when we're talking about our corner, just imagine, you know, that's, that's zero degrees, that's your direct front. I mean, I guess that's 90. So, ah, uh, maths. Okay, 180 and then 270. Okay, so this is our 270 degrees and then we're going halfway. So 270, 315. Can you see the cogs working? Is that right? At me in the comments if you think my maths is wrong. So, so three, at 315 degrees, we're kind of facing our body. So this is, imagine there's a torch in the center of your chest. That's where it's facing, okay? We're going to pick it up with our right hand. So face left side, right hand. We're going to touch our left shoulder. So it's kind of like you're about to do sign of the cross. <laughs> okay, we're going to touch our left shoulder with our right. Touch your left shoulder with your left hand. So right now I'm looking a bit like this, but I'm to the corner. Okay, and then we're going to go behind with our right hand, behind with our left hand. When we're doing this, we're changing our angle. We're going to go in front with our right hand to our right shoulder and then in front with our left hand. So now we're moving over to the 45 degree angle. We're gonna throw away our right, throw away our left and try not to hit ourselves in the chin. We're gonna pick it up now with our left. So facing the right side, left hand. We're gonna pick it up to our right shoulder, right shoulder, back, back, left shoulder, left shoulder, throw, throw. Okay, so it's like a cascading kind of motion. So we're going to go right hand, left hand, back and back and right shoulder, right shoulder, throw and throw. Left side, ready? Left side to your left, right shoulder and touch the front, touch the front, touch the back, touch the back, touch the front, touch the front, throw and throw. Cool. Little bit faster, ready? Five, six, seven, right hand, touch the front, front, back, back, front, front, throw. And left, front, front, back, back, front, front, throw. Let me show you that without angles. So our right is going to come to this shoulder. One, two, three, four, five, six, throw. Left, one, two, three, four, five, six, throw. Let's do it again. Right, left, right, left, right, left, and throw again. Left, right, left, right, left, right, and add those angles. One, two, three, four, five, six, throw. And one, two, three, four, five, six, throw. Let's try that with music. Ready? Okay, just on your technique. Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, throw. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, Throw a bit faster. One, two. Okay, that was much faster. Again. All right, let's slow it down. And going, touch. Two, three, four, five, six, throw. And left, one, two, three, four. I don't know what happened with my hands there. Okay, we're gonna try everything now that you've learned. And we're gonna try it really fast. So let's do once, everything slow. Then try it really, really fast. Ready? Here we go. Five, six, right hand whack. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, both hands. One, two, three, four. One, two, ready, double tap. Both, both, again. Right, left, both, both, last time. Both. Both, real last time. Ah, oh, nice, okay, let's try alternating. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Ready, let's try it faster. Five, six, seven, Eight and one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and one. Okay, bit of a whirlwind, 
Let's try alternating. First slow, well the second alternating. Five, six, seven, eight, go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Continuously, one, two. Continuously slow, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, key. Two, three, four, pick it up. Two, three, four, last time, pick it up. Three, four, one. Okay, I'm just gonna move my hair. Okay, ready? We're gonna do a double time. Five, six, seven, eight, go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. I forgot what I was doing. And alternate. Down. One, two, three, four, down. And keep going. Ooh. Slow beats are really fast when you go double time. Okay, <laughs> last one. Facing the corner, break it down nice and slow. Right hand to left shoulder. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Right, left, right, left, right, left, and throw. Left, right, left, right, left, right, and throw. Again. One, two, three, four, five, six, and throw. And one, two, three, four, five, six, and throw. Double time. One and two and three and four. 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 Okay, dancers, thank you so much for learning a little bit of whacking technique with me. So make sure you practice so you come back next week a strong whacker as opposed to a whack dancer. Okay, next, next in Technique Week with Drea, we have a little bit of Kathak technique. So you can just do some Kathak drills and combine them with your whacking and make some really stunning Bollywood fusion. If you want to check out more Bollywack artists, definitely check out Kumari Suraj, queen and mother of the Bollywack movement, and also Joya Kazi and Riti Sheik. I hope I'm saying her name correctly. If you want to learn some choreography, I'm going to link a tutorial over here. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow.